further news at all on, on whether you might be able to get Luke Barney on a, a more permanent basis? I haven't got any problems about that anyway. It's in our hands and it's about his wages. And at the moment he's above our wage limit, so either you want to come down and get in ours or we've got to push ours up. So I, I anticipate talking to my chairman about how we're going and what we're doing and where we're going in January. He, I was expecting to see him yesterday, but he's coming in on Monday and I'll sit down with him and discuss these things. He's already made some offers to some lads who are out of contract. Um, where they are with him, I'm not sure. I don't think they've accepted his offer and whether his offer was our final offer or not, I don't know yet. So, uh, as I say, I've got enough to try and deal with. I, I try and get these players and work them in a shape and work them in a system. I had far too many to bring in in the summer. I don't really anticipate too many coming in in January, if any at all, because I like to get my lot, get them settled and work with them. Believe in them and then get them doing what I want. So, um, obviously, Reg is one of those. Luke is one of those, that's what I mean. Luke Varney, Reg Varney, whatever. Um, he belongs at the moment to someone else. We've got a deal in place saying that we're definitely going to buy him if if we want to. So, you know, surely that's our decision and we can make that happen. But it's his overall wages, which yeah, were which yeah. were the problem in the summer. That's why we only borrowed him in the summer. But the, the, the amount of money we're going to buy him f from them is already nailed down. And there's no way they can say no at the moment. The only person who can say no is Luke himself and his agent. And I'll try and keep his agent away from my chairman. <laughs> and we might have a chance of doing a deal. This weekend, yeah, what a fantastic, fantastic uh, job Owen's doing there. Um, almost the same sort of players. And, you know, he's got his own mark on it now. And they're banging goals in left, right and centre. And El Manda's now... Everybody's favourite when nobody liked him a couple of years ago. It's brilliant. It's great to see, and uh, I'll be very proud to take my lot there. Any concerns about obviously you talked about being happy to, to, to stay the way you're playing, but the number of goals you can see you can see that so far is that, is that becoming a concern, or are you still happy to, to carry on with the same philosophy? I'm sure there's other people with a lot more to worry about than I got, and if we can keep doing what we do, and we I believe we're going to score. I don't believe. Anybody can stop the might of the people that we'll be facing week in, week out, scoring every week. So I'm not even concerned about that. 